That's right, family. Black power, black power is the truth. Hour with General Sarah soon said he kicked back. Get your mind ready for some information that's guaranteed to be hefty. That's right, family. We're excited and delighted to be accepting members to the Sarah Sutton SETI YouTube page, a dynamic page. Y'all already know what it is. You see, we don't need no hype over here. <clears throat> we got uh, the link to join is in the video description. It's also in the chat room. What you can do, you uh, click that link. It'll give you a, a video introduction, rundown on the memberships, what they entail, dynamic if you see one of the memberships you like join you see if not we still appreciate you over here at sarah soon said his youtube page continue to engage continue to grow that's right uh this sunday is going down is going down creatures from the caucus in game prophecy fulfillment live stream lecture presented by general seti that's right sunday june 25th you already know what it is the classic of classics, the making of the white man. You do not want to miss this right here. Click that General SETI dot, uh, dot ticket leap dot com. General SETI dot ticket leap dot com. SETI keep it leaping on ticket leap. You'll see all the videos in queue. You can get your tickets ahead of time. Most definitely, I keep nothing but fire. You understand what I'm saying on General SETI dot ticket leap dot com. Be in the house this Sunday. Creatures from the caucus. That's right. Ring the alarm. King SETI.com. Online marketplace. Official general. Sarah Sutton SETI. DVD lectures. T-shirts. Tank tops. Hoodies. Uh, African and Egyptian uh, jewelry. Comet, holistic tonics and remedies. Home decor accessories for every room in the house. We got the DVDs. Classic and Jurassic. We got over 50, 60 on deck. That is nowhere to be found other than in this collection. We got the tank top. Uh, for the uh, sisters, we got uh, T-shirts, uh, over 50, 60 new ones for the summer. You see what I'm saying? You need to go in there, check them out. We got the youth. We got the children's T-shirts. Young Gifted in Black, RBG Jr. We got the mugs for you sipping your lattes and your green juices. We got you. We got the tote bags also for your knowledge, your computers, or whatever you want to use it for. And so get on. No, and at this time, we got 25 percent. Did you hear me? We got 25 percent off selected products. So you can come over right now. You can get a discount and you can get you something nice. That's real talk. So get on over there. KingSetty.com. GeneralSetty.com. Pull the fire alarm. It's GeneralSetty.com. Seti University. That's right. Over 1,000 video presentations on african history heritage spirituality nation building uh mental warfare advanced african academic developing the black nation one lesson at a time the complete general sarah soon said website you should get your behind in class today we got catalogs and libraries on egypt new world order uh uh the hindu kush also, Rise of the Neanderthals, Omeka, God, Deception, Christianity, Islam, Jude. We got all the subjects you know and love from the general. We got that on General SETI in abundance and nothing but fire. So you cannot be dupl it cannot be duplicated. So come and binge on Black Power, General SETI.com, SETI University is the place to be general seti popping on patreon bpc making noise we never come exclusive live stream too hot to handle on youtube or so exquisite we keep it for our family on patreon hot german egyptologists use viking culture to create words in the medunetta how the church steeple and the islamic minaret was stolen from the ancient egyptian obelisk did the viking runes evolve from the ancient egyptian medunetta and lost ancient egyptian temples in southern india that's right and so th that right there is fire and so i want you over there and of course we got the champagne and the false teachers of the medunetta classes still going down on patreon make sure you subscribe to all my youtube channels king seti general seti sarah soon seti rock that notification bell get a video a thumbs up like it because you love it share it with your family and friends and comment 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 just don't say nothing stupid because i will 
ban your ass. Now we dealing right now with uh Bess and Pata magic magic men from uh from the Congo, oldest gods of ancient Egypt, oldest gods of ancient Egypt, showing the preeminence of Southern Africa. You see, showing the preeminence of Southern Africa. Let's deal with this. Bingo. Now, here we go. Let's get in the house. That's right. Now, we back on the Narmas palette. You see, we back on the Narmas palette. And when you, you know, this is the oldest document of, you know, of United Ancient Egypt. United Ancient Egypt, okay? You see, so this is the, the oldest official document. And you see Narma in a Masonic parade. You see, you see Narma in a Masonic parade. You see uh, the Twa with the totem poles. You see, you see, uh, uh, you see even the, uh, the Pharaoh's placenta is there. You see the last pole, you see the placenta with the, with the unbiblical cord hanging from the from the sack, you see, and so that shows you there that they deified childbirth. You see that the Afri that childbirth was was a, a act of holiness and, and and sacredness. You feel me? And so you know this was you know this was worshipped. You know what I'm saying? That a childbirth was worshipped. You know so. That right there show you right there that they want no no crazy shit right there, you see, no they want no no they want no no crazy shit. They was into you know what count, you know, and they was into what count. Now when you go and you talk about the first peoples of Egypt, you know, was the Ainu, and I I went in on because. A lot of people don't know that this is the root of Anunnaki. You see, these niggas looking up in outer space and this, that, and the third. The Anunnaki came from the Nile Valley. You see, the Anunnaki came from the Nile Valley. The first people of Egypt, you see. And so on this, you know, on this uh, small little, what you call, uh, I believe it was carved on a piece of stone. In his name, the French e Egyptologist Emile uh, em em Emilou, em Emilou, who dedicated himself uh, to the first dynasties and ex excavated for the first time the tomb uh, of the pharaohs of the first dynasty in Upper Egypt, discovered the evidences of a highly developed people named the Anu and who were black African. These people practiced breeding and agriculture all along the Nile. They mastered the use of metals, of ivory, were very organized and knew how to write. They live inside cities protected by walls. This was proven by many artifacts from them found in the region of Abydos, okay? Uh, the Ainu people founded many Egyptian cities, and these cities' names were composed from the root Enta, I W N W. Okay, and so in you, I N I N you, whatever, however you they pronounce, because you ain't supposed to be pronouncing it. Okay, so really is written out. So I would just you know write it out I W N W. S M A W. Okay. And so, and of course, Heliopolis, which they say the city of the sun. All these elements are backed up by the latest archaeological findings in these areas. Scholars discovered the first people who settled around the Nile Valley lived between the extreme south of Egypt and Sudan 7000 BC. See? 
And what's crazy about it, that the eight new people, which is the twa, that's what that's all they is. That's they the twa. Let me get it to clear. The twa. That's who it is. You see, who bringing this knowledge down here, and they worship. You see, set. See, see. So that's where you get the term Tasetti. You see the brothers. I see the brother. The brother had threw it in there to laugh. You get Tasetti. You see. This is crazy because a lot of people don't even they when they you know when you ask them about set, you know, I say you know and, and people's always talking about evil and shit. I say, is that all you get? What kind of studies is you doing? You see, you know that set was the supreme or soot. That's right. The vials is interchangeable. You see, it could be sat. You see, it could be sat. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it could be sat. It could be S A T. It could be O. Like you get soot. S S S O O T, which is black. You see? Now, nah, you know, as they switch and, you know, as you get sat, you know, you get sat turn. You see? You get sat turn. You see, or set term, okay? But not the attributes that they got, but these are some of these deities that's, you know, breaking, you know, that they breaking breaking off and revising and creating and, and so on and so forth. Like, amen. You, it could be, you could add the A, amen. It could be, I mean, you know, I am, I am. Uh, a M I N. The vowels is interchangeable because really there is no vowels. So how you add the vowels is up to you. You see what I'm saying? You know they. You know it's, how you add the vowels is up to you because it's supposed to be written out anyway. You see. And so now we're dealing with a new. The first peoples of of the Nile of Egypt, and you can see that is the twa. Now, if you go to uh now this is the reason why it's blurry because it's the megapixels is crazy. You see, now I seen this for myself three times. This was in the uh ma uh master the master by Ameruka. You can look it up. You see, and, and so the, here you got the twa. This is best in Pata. You can see they you see they got the aprons on, they brothers of the crab. And they're uh they're jewelry makers. That's very significant. So this is where when you get all these these uh like even in uh Thor, you see when you get uh in, what's his name E Tree E Tree, who is the the dwarf who created the 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 mallet in 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 all of the 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 magical weaponry of, of, of the gods. You see what I'm saying? of the gods and so you see that this leg this so-called legacy is carrying on you see what i'm saying it, from culture to culture you see you see it even in the old mech you see it over in the hindu kush you see and so you see they brothers of the craft and that they are the ones that you know you see them here making jewelry also this is in this is at the tomb of Maruka, you know and so how long have they been doing this now? You know, how long, have, how long have, you know, they, they ain't just getting started. You talking about, uh, you talking about Maruka and them, they was, they was in the, uh, I believe Maruka could have been in the fifth dynasty. I don't know if Maruka was in the fifth dynasty. I had to go back and check, you see, but he's in, he's, he's in the, uh, you know he's over there by Sakara. You know the the great uh the great pyramid of Sakara built built by Zosia. You see when uh built by Emotep for Zosia. You see, and so not even that when we talk about now this is the battlefield palette. Now this is another uh this is another uh palette that they found down in. What they call Hierakonopolis or Nikon, 
And now you can see right there, Hierakonopolis. Now, if you know you, you got to study your maps now. You got to study your maps so you know what's, you know, you can see right there that, uh, now that, I don't even believe that's the one. That's, that's it is. That's the one right there. That's the one. Hierakonopolis. So you see right here, Aswan. You see what I'm saying? You deep south. But even up in here, you south, you, you, you deep south. You know what I'm saying? Hierakonopolis is deep south. And so this is where Narma, Scorpion King, you see, all the pre then this is where they this is at this at Hierakonopolis is where they found a treasure cho a trove. You found the uh the Narma palette, the battle uh field palette. The uh, scorpion mace head, the uh, Narma's mace head, and tons of mo material, tons of mo material, and and as you can see, there seem to be some discrepancies with the twa. I don't know why. There's some discrepancies with the twa. You know, they 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 have them, and you know, and so this is a pre-dynastic battle. You know what I'm saying? This is a pre-dynastic battle going on. You see? And so you see uh you see the you see the falcon, you even see the ibis up there too. It look like the ibis is up there too. You know? So you see Horus, you see Tahuti, you see? But, you know, it's showing that in that which they rarely show is the heavy influence of the Twa in early Egypt. You know, now to the right, see, this is best, but to the right is Pata. You see, because they, they never tell you that Pata was a Twa and that the that the, the uh, nation of Egypt is named after what they quote unquote call a pygmy. You see, quote unquote, what they call a pygmy. Now, this is something, you know, very powerful too. You see, the fact that even when the the, the 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 Ptolemies came into Egypt, yeah, when they came into Egypt, Bess was still venerated, you know, to uh, you know, to a great extent. Now this was a you know, he was you know, he's considered to be a a, a deity of magic. You see, because this is a magical stellar right here, this stellar with you know, this Ptolemaic uh, Stella. But, you know, Bess is still the Godhead. Now, that's very interesting. You see, the Greeks, you know, didn't, they didn't gave up some information. They wasn't in there really trying to change shit. You know, when the Greeks first came into Egypt, they wasn't trying to change shit. They was trying to be down. That was it. So it wasn't no, so here you see, even with the Ptolemies, when they came in, Bess was highly venerated. So how and why are these little people being worshipped on a level like that? You see, because they are the seed people. They have the oldest walk on the planet. They have the oldest walk on the planet. And so not only did they found Egypt, Nubia, they found in Nubia too. You see, they went all throughout, you know, Asia, Southern Asia. Here's a map showing you the starting point, you know, and 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 how they move. Now, see, I had to create some of my own maps because see, right here it shows that they walked, and 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 that's not true, you know. Our people did not walk. Our people were on ships. And see, and, and I had to show y'all that by showing you the one island in the middle of the Indian Ocean with our people on it. Our people ain't walk nowhere, okay? Our people was, and that's why when you look at our re, re, religiosity, you look up in, into the, you know, into the, you know, the ceilings of the temples, you see uh, the deities moving on arcs. They on the celestial now, you see. And so you go to Dendera, you see all the deities sailing on the celestial now in an arc. 
you see in an ark, the bark of eternity, the, 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 the bark of a million years. You see, that's what, you know, and so we never walk no damn where, you know, and as we charted the oceans and the seas at the same time, we charted the stars, you see, because this was the, you know, this was our, our way of locating where we was charting where we was so when we moved back and forth you know we knew how to guide ourselves to get back and forth these were the stars were guide posts you see to and in and indicators of where we were at on the planet you see and so our people charted all the way around okay our people circumnavigated the globe and charted everywhere they went so they was the first people on the planet with a complete understanding of the cosmos you understand what i'm saying from an earthly view okay and many of them astro projected because the way they they knew and the thing is our people didn't been on the planet for so long you see charting you know that we didn't been in areas of this of this galaxy that people will never be in your time is you know our time is past we won't be in those you know but i you know our descendants will be in those you know those particular houses or, or the cosmos you see but we as a people we have been calculating and 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 the twa the twa obviously were the ones that did the, the foremost research they did the foremost research in charting the stars and charting the uh the oceans you see and so we got to quit thinking our people just walks in ain't nobody just gonna get up and go get, get the fucking walking what, what what make you what what would make you just walk up out of africa and just say fucking i'm gonna just walk you understand what I'm saying? Until I, you know, you in the prime real estate on, on earth. You in the prime real estate on earth. What make you just up and start walking? You know what I'm saying? And you just gonna walk up out of and you know where are you going? When when will you know when you get where you're going if you ain't never been nowhere? If you always been in Africa, how the hell you gonna know? So you just gonna aimlessly walk? You and especially when you leave up out of Egypt, you're gonna be in a goddamn desert. So I don't know what would make nobody. Our people was explorers. They was explorers. You see, they was explorers. And so when they left, they they were you know they were charting, you know you know and and, and looking for new regions to establish colonies and whatnot. You see, and so you know that was what and they were on ships. And they were, you know, going and coming. They wasn't just walking aimlessly. They were doing uh, scouting expeditions and they were charting. You know, they started first around Africa. You see what I'm saying? You know, Southern Arabia, something that's close that you can get. Then they just skirted the uh, shorelines. That's what they did. They, you know, that's how they, you know, they, they skirted the shorelines. And that's, this is how they got to the area all throughout Asia and so on and so forth. You see, that's how they did it. They did not walk. You see, they did not walk. Because the only way you're going to be able to get resources, you're going to have to sell it in. And then, you know, and, you know, you got to go back and forth. You ain't going to be able to walk and go back. You're not going to do that. You see, only the vagabonds, such as the the Arabs and so on and so forth, they did that. You see what I'm saying? And that's why they as was, was never found in, in civilization until just recently, you see? And so you see that they, you know, that the Twa moved from, you know, from Africa and they went straight across. They did not, goddamn, they sailed right on across. You see what I'm saying? It's islands all through the Indian Ocean that you know our peoples is on that people don't even know they there you know and 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 i believe that's why they don't show islands on a lot of these maps so when they go oppress them they won't have nobody that they can reach out and and, and you know 
and, and, and uh, protest, you know, and have protests for them, you see? And so when you talk about, you know, best, you know, and you, you can see, you know, best got that tongue. He always got that tongue sticking out, which is the lion. You see, if you watch the lion, I got the video. I don't know if I put it on this one, though. I didn't, but that's all right. You will see the, the lion. You can see the lion mane around his face. Now, this is in India. And you can see where they didn't take taking the lion mane. You can see that now a lot of times them Africans are going to have them arm and shape eyes. You see what I'm saying? And and Bess is known to have <clears throat> the, 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 uh, I don't know if they, uh, what are they, what are they, not, they're not tattoos, but they're, they're like carved in the skin. You see what I'm saying? And so, you know, a lot of our people, you know, they put carvings in, in the skin. And so I believe, you know, but best, you know, a lot of times have these carvings or, you know what I'm saying? Over the eyes in the, on the forehead. Now you can see right here in the old Mecca land, you see what I'm saying? The old Mecca land, you see best in the uh in the calendar you see you see best in the middle that just let you know who created it because wherever you go on the planet it's the same thing they acknowledge now this is in the uh from new zealand the maori see now you wouldn't you know where did he get that from see the re you know who he got it from he got it from the africans who took it over there and showed this dumb man but you see how they keep putting them you know and you have to watch that you can see it all over the world. You see, you know, even from here, you know, you see here the markings and then here it is in India. Now this is supposed to be Medusa, but see, that's why I was trying to tell y'all and show y'all that the Titans are the Africans. They the giants. You understand? But now that's the irony of it. You understand what I'm saying? That this is a twa. You see what I'm saying? But even when you look at uh uh the Anunnaki, many of those, and I showed y'all the pictures that they show you of Gilgamesh, and that's a best. So a lot of time they take his face, and though he's a twa, they might put it on somebody that's full, you know, might be, you know, a taller, it might be a giant. You see what I'm saying? But he, that just show you that he's the supreme deity and that there's many manifestations of him. You see, but here you see right here in Greece, the same uh, the same deity that had been taken all over the world. And not and what's so crazy that they even got imagery of Bass as a samurai. When I've seen this, I say, man, this is this can't be true, man. This cannot be true, but when I seen it, I knew exactly what it was. I say, damn, this, this got to regale your other damn samurai. There's no doubt about it, because when you look at it, and I broke it down for you, you can see he got the, you know, he got the uh, the sheaf. I believe they call them sleeves or, or sheaves. You see that guard, the, the growing area. You see what I'm saying? You see... You see, he got his 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 lower uh, uh, his lower apparatus to guard his legs. You see right there, to guard the leg. You see, you see, a, he, a, he even got the the chest plate. You see, he got the chest plate up there. He, you know, he he, he got on. You see, he got the helmet because you can see down here. You know what I'm saying? Is is down to his chin. You see, you see the helmet. And you see right here, the, his, his, you know, you know, you got to have your, you know, your funky feathers, you know what I'm saying, to top it off. But you see, this is the regalia or the un uniform of the samurai. It ain't no damn doubt about it. You see what I'm saying? And so this was, it, when they went to war, this was, you know, the twa would have on. And the crazy thing about it, you know, Bess is also, if you ever watch a Star Trek, if y'all watch uh, Return of the Jedi, the little Ewoks, you see the little Ewoks? That's that's Bess. 
You see what I'm saying? So they keep, and you see how they had them in the forest. You know what I'm saying? You know, they was in the forest. You see? Who was, who was that brother? Who was that brother, Ray? The brother, S-A-M-E-I. What's it, Who is he? Samurai? Oh, okay. Well, that's a, that's a, you know what, that's just something, you know, but that whether they had it or not, don't make no difference. You know, whether they had, it just let you know what the primary institute, who established the primary institution, all that, you know, a samurai must have one drop of, how the fuck is you going to get one drop of black blood? You see what I'm saying? And that is, that's goddamn impossible. And so family, we're going to keep it mo moving. We drop it. You pushing hard today. Uh, best and Pata magic men of the Congo, oldest gods of ancient Egypt. We ain't done. We're gonna touch back on this very, very soon on a deeper level. This is General Sara soon said he said, Hey, arm yourself with knowledge, bang on that wicked ass beast, daily liberation through African education and confrontation. Black power.